Hey guys, today I'm doing my November favorites. Oh wait, it's mid-December. November slash mid-December favorites. For this favorites video, I'm gonna show you two or three different products in each category being hair, makeup, and random slash stuff that I just like. First things first, this is like why I wanted to make a favorites video in the first place, was to share with you my new curling iron, in case you don't watch my vlogmas videos. Here it is, it's a Con Air, just regular old Con Air, a one and a quarter inch curling iron, um, and it was like $18.99 at Target, and I've used it literally every day for the past week. What I do is I just curl it like that, without the clamp, wrapping it around. Super easy, absolutely love this would make a great Christmas gift to like a friend because it's really just not even expensive and it's great. Second favorite is this shampoo and conditioner. It's the Living Proof shampoo and conditioner that, that they have at Sephora. It's kind of hard to describe shampoo and conditioner without you actually using it, but it smells good, makes my hair feel very clean, and detangles. I mean, that's just typical shampoo and conditioner things. It's kind of like you have to try it to know. On to makeup. First favorite for makeup is Urban Decay Primer Potion in Sin. I didn't realize this before, but I literally use this every single day for the past like couple of months. When I don't wear it, I feel weird. I'm like, oh, this is weird. I feel like my eyes get like greasy or something. I love it. I use it every day. Next makeup favorite is the Eyes on the 60s palette from BH Cosmetics. I use this in my Lily Collins makeup tutorial. If you haven't checked that out, Go check it out. Like if you want to see a tutorial with this palette, then that's up already, so you can check it out. It has 30 colors and it has like a bunch of bright ones, but then also a bunch of neutrals that I use like on the more of everyday basis. Urban Decay Primer Potion in Sin plus some of these. I love it. These are all very like pigmented. If you're looking for a nice palette that has neutrals and bright colors and they're all pigmented very nicely and it's not too expensive, check out the BH Cosmetics palette. Speaking of BH Cosmetics, I want to try the It's Judy Time palette. Does anyone else just really want to try that? Because it looks amazing. Next, for kind of makeup nails actually, um, this is my favorite nail polish duo in the color Save the Date and Wedding Crusher. Love, love the color purple. I think red is just like so typical for the holidays. And lastly, for makeup favorites, a Benefit Brow Gel. I used to not even use a brow gel. My brows would just go crazy and look weird. As you can actually see in my Christmas wish list video, I didn't use this brow gel that day. Dumb idea, because one of them was like going that way. The best part, random favorites. Okay, these are so good. Oh my God, okay. Trader Joe's Mini Gingerbread Man Cookies. I love them. It comes with a ton, so they kind of take forever to finish. Like, share them with your family. The, the icing, it tastes so good. Like, if you have tea with this or like coffee with this, it's so good. Like, it's my favorite cookie snack thing ever. My last random favorite is guess what it is? It's a music favorite, so guess. Midnight Memories, duh. Black Dress and Little White Lies are my favorite songs from the album. I love it. I love how it's not as like pop-y, but more rock-y. I love it. It's great. It's great. Little Black Dress is so good. Okay. Let me know what your favorite is. Comment below. And um, check out my Vlogmas videos. And also, check out Twin Tuesday if you haven't yet. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!